Of course, with Mercedes-Benz, we're on the road. With GNSS, we can get around, but lane accuracy, that precision is not high enough yet. Also, high-definition maps are costly and not widely available. Geoflex offers a scalable solution for lane-level positioning, and it will be introduced to us by Ludovic Priva. He has the details, please. Hello, everybody. Uh, so actually, my friend Ludovic is out here. He's uh, going to uh, attend the speech. And I'm Nicholas Berger, uh, presenting uh, the, the vision of uh, Geoflex. So Geoflex is doing uh, high precision positioning due to satellite means, I will explain. And we are very proud to be part of the laureate of uh, Mercedes-Benz uh, uh, car to space uh, contest. So let me jump to the first slide. So I share with you one of the proof points of what we did in the car industry. Uh, so we did a drive test in Paris with uh, an automotive grade GNSS receiver, three frequency. And uh, on the left, so in uh, yellow, you get uh, the drive tracks that we have recorded without any corrections. And uh, if you look at the right, so we took the same recording from uh, GNSS signals and apply the all corrections, and you get uh, the right tracks. And uh, so we get uh, some things that uh, get further smoother if we take the average, and which is 20, 20 centimeters away from the center lane. So what we have proven is that we are able to derive new geometry of uh, lane level uh, streets just by 10 drive tests. So we Geoflex have a unique value proposition we uh, enable car makers to improve position of their car from metric accuracy to centimetric accuracy by software means. We are a GNSS uh, software, uh, a GNSS uh, service operator uh, taking care of uh, satellite based errors. And uh, we leverage on seven patents uh, from the French space agency uh, CNES. And um, today we are doing a fundraising uh, to fuel growth, a fundraising uh, Series A, uh, to, to grow in uh, the automotive sector. If we look at what we can bring to the automotive, um, so usually positioning is uh, done with uh, three uh, components in the, sense, in the sensor fusion uh, features. It's a computer vision, uh, map data, and GNSS. And if you add on top, the GNSS correction that we can bring, then we can improve by a factor 10 the precision of the GNSS. And uh, it's worth just a few euros. And furthermore, uh, we can uh, integrate that very easily in the software stack. Uh, it's uh, only software, no need of extra hardware. And finally, uh, this provides a much stronger integrity of uh, the system of the sensor fusion and uh, so it can make up for the other sensors. So now if we look at kind of the car ecosystem, usually there is one part on the left on the diagram that is off board and one other part on the right which is on board of the car, it's the car electronics. So we get started from the left. So typically we have a lane level maps that is streamed to the car. The car can then itself locate and establish on which lane it's driving. It can be plotted on, the, uh, on the, the map in the infotainment system. Furthermore, the car itself can detect new geometry that are not existing in the map and feed that to the map server. So at the end, we are creating a, a virtuous cycle that is improving step by step the map and uh, that is adding geometry and coverage. So at the end, uh, what we are showing is that uh, to, to Geoflex is able to uh, scale up uh, positioning in car to, to enable lane level map at massive scale and opening up a new use case for the car industry. I thank you very much and I hope that you are supporting us uh, in developing this in the car industry and further on. Thank you very much. Nicolas Burger, thank you very much. Uh, first of the Mercedes-Benz challenges.